We're certainly looking at what we can do with regards to legislation. I have had meetings with academics from UWC who have been doing long-term research into various forms of smoking, being ochre pipes and e-cigarettes as well. So there is a lot of research that is coming out that is indicating we need to start looking at the limitations that the World Health Organization wishes to bring about. We do need to wait for the national minister at this particular point because tobacco is controlled by national tobacco legislation. So although this is a nicotine product, what he has indicated is that there will be a review of the national legislation to allow it to also cover issues like e-cigarettes using vaporized nicotine. Currently we have to await on that in order to be able to enforce that on a national basis and on a city basis. But we are also certainly within the city in terms of our actual physical buildings also looking at the limitation of e-cigarettes indoors. At this point I would say if private owners are interested in limiting the use of e-cigarettes on their premises, the best point of call would be to come to us, to my office, and we can either give them the information or put them in contact with people who can give them further information.